What's going on everyone? This is Kevin Breeze here and in this video we're going to go over how to take a screenshot with the Samsung Galaxy J2 for Metro by T-Mobile. So let's get started. Now the process of taking a screenshot is actually really simple. All you have to do is hold down the power button and hold down the volume down button at the same time and it takes the screenshot instantly. Then from there you can pull down the shade and you'll see that the screenshot is right there waiting for you. So tap on it to view it, and then you'll have the option to open it up with your gallery or photos. I usually do gallery, and then you can tap on just once or always, depending on if you want to set it as the default. Then from there, it's going to pull up your gallery, and then it's going to pull up the actual screenshot itself. Now you actually have a lot of editing options here. Now the first thing you can do up here on the top is you can tap on the heart to favorite it so that it's in a special section of your gallery. But then you can also tap on this button on the top right corner with the three dots and you have some different options here. So you can view details about the actual screenshot itself. You can set this screenshot as your wallpaper, which I'm not sure if you'd ever want to do that. You can show the date and location tags. You can print with a compatible printer and you can open this up in the Photo Editor Pro. Now, we can do the Photo Editor Pro in a separate video, but for now I wanted to show you the editing options that are actually built into the gallery here. So taking a look on the bottom here, the first option is to crop and rotate. So we're going to tap on that and see what we can do with this. Tap on allow. And you can see that you can crop, like you can crop pretty much any image, and that's really easy. You can also go over here on the left side here in the bottom, and you can tap and rotate around. You can rotate it 90 degrees with each tap. You can also rotate it at a more precise angle on the bottom here, so it really gets nice and precise. And then you can also crop to certain dimensions. So there's one by one. So if you want to crop to one by one, you can tap on that and do that. Then from there on the bottom here, we have another option. And this option is to add filters. So these are Instagram style filters, and there's quite a few to choose from here. So you can kind of go through these and see if you like any of them. Of course, if you don't like any of them at all, then you can always go back to no effect. You can also add stickers. So there's a whole bunch of stickers here and you even have the ability to add even more stickers. You can download some of these. So you can do that through Samsung's pre-installed software. But a lot of these stickers that are already here are pretty cool. So you can add those. You can even add extra text. So. If you want to add that text, you can even add a little box around it. You can change the color of that text and the box that's behind it. And you can place this anywhere you want on your screenshot. And then finally, we have a pretty cool pen tool here. So there's a variety of different pen tips. You can choose more of a pencil style, a pen, or a paintbrush. And then you can choose, of course, the color that that draws in. And then you can draw all over your screenshot if you wish. This would probably come more in handy if you wanted to take some notes on something and maybe you can use the pen tool for example and maybe pick black like a darker color and write some sort of note so you can write that on your screenshot. But essentially there's a variety of different editing options included within the gallery which is really great to see. If you want to revert back to the original image you can always tap on reset but if you're happy with it as it is now you can tap on save and it'll save all of your changes and you can find this in your screenshots folder. But I hope you enjoyed this video on how to screenshot with the Samsung Galaxy J2 for Metro by T-Mobile. This is Kevin Breeze here. Make sure to sub and like this video if you liked the video and I'll see you in the next one. And if you have any questions at all or any special requests you'd like about the Samsung Galaxy J2, then let me know down in the comment section below. But I'll see you in the next one.